Welcome to Inawara's Simplify SAP Create It Now series. In this video, we will demonstrate how to create an F-32 Clear Customer automation script utilizing Inawara's Process Runner Enterprise. Before we create our automation script, let's enter FBL5N in our SAP GUI and view the customer line item display for one of our customers 300619. The document numbers listed here, except for the documents ending in 19 and 45, have been inputted into this Excel spreadsheet. We are just submitting these two documents to show that not all would have to be processed. Also in this Excel spreadsheet is the additional data that will be utilized to clear these documents. To record our automation script, let's begin by opening up Process Runner Enterprise and double-clicking New Transaction. Now in the new process pop-up window, in the transaction code box, let's enter F-32 and push the start recording button. Let's follow the prompts and log into the appropriate SAP system in our SAP landscape. We will bring up our Excel spreadsheet in the background so that we can see our first set of data as well as the SAP GUI. On this Clear Customer Header Data screen, let's enter the account number 300619, clearing date 6-6-2006, and company code 1000. Now we will push Enter, and then push Enter once again to account for this error message. Here in the Clear Customer Process Open Item screen, Let's push the Select All button, and then push Deactivate Items. We will push Select All once again, and we will select Deactivate Discount. Now let's push Field Content Search, and from the selected search criteria pop-up, select Document Number, and push Enter. We will enter our first document number, 1000, 0, 0, 0, 0 in this from box and check string and push enter. Once again we will push select all and this time select activate items. Next let's push document overview and on this clear customer display overview screen enter our posting key 40 and GL account number 4730000 and push enter. Here on the Clear Customer Add GL Account item screen, in Amount, let's enter an asterisk, and then enter our tax code, V0. Next, we will push on the back arrow, and on this coding block screen, we will enter Business Area 9900 and Cost Center 1110, and then push Enter. Now from the document dropdown of our SAP GUI, we will select Simulate, and after reviewing our result, we will push the Save button to end our script recording process. Let's bring up Process Runner Enterprise. Here in the Mapper ribbon of Process Runner, let's select Use External Excel File to link our script recording to our desired data set. Now we need to verify our mapping. Each of our fields in our script recording are properly mapped to our Excel spreadsheet, so our mapping process is complete. Let's go to the Home ribbon and set our Start Row and End Row. We will keep the default Start Row of 2 and set our End Row to 22. We can execute our automation script here from the Home ribbon of Process Runner by simply clicking Run, but let's go to the Mapper ribbon of Process Runner, where we will be able to view our external Excel file as our script executes. Here in the Mapper ribbon, let's press Run. 
We will follow the prompts and save our script to a location on our hard drive or network. Now we will log into SAP and then watch as the script executes. The SAP success messaging has written directly to our Excel spreadsheet. Let's bring up our SAP GUI and view our customer line item display now. Only documents 19 and 45 which were not on our Excel spreadsheet, remain to be processed. We have successfully created an F-32 automation script allowing us to clear customer accounts with Inawera's Process Runner Enterprise. Want to learn more about simplifying SAP with Inawera technologies? Visit us at inawera.com. Thank you for watching.